Hawthorne has a mighty history when it comes to sharpshooters. Full forwards Peter Hudson and Jason Dunstall booted the ton 11 times between them. Tonight, another man, Lance Buddy Franklin, can join the list. At Carlton, Harry Soapy Valance racked up the goals in the 1930s, but the Blues have only one centurion, the great Alex Jezelenko in 1970. Can Brendan Favola join him tonight? Welcome to the shootout at the Dome. Well, tonight, welcome to Buddy Watch. We're going to have the, the score ticking over, his goal tally ticking over. The big question is, who's going to get the job on him? I guess there's a couple of men that could take him tonight, Rob, for Carl. I think Jared Wade will get the job. Jared Wade's been uh, playing as a key defender all year for the Blues. He's been in really good form. He's tall, he's athletic. I hope he plays a little bit in front of him. And then, of course, there's Brett Thornton. Thornton's the veteran at that back line. He's been around a long time, had some tough jobs. So they've got a couple of tall athletic players who I think can play. Play on buddy and yes we got fev watch too that'll hopefully for carlton fans be ticking over as the night progresses he needs eight for his hundred will it be gillam or will it be crow a big test for both those guys it is look stephen gillam's been given the job uh, all year on the full forwards trent crowd of course over 200 games experience i think they'll start with young gillam if it doesn't work out trent crowd will get the job and they'll move him pretty quickly gee bauer has gone to franklin Paul that's the power to franklin that's a massive surprise Bowers only played 20 odd games for Carlton and only half the games this year so that is interesting look he's tall he's quick and Crowd the veteran has gone to Favola Gibbs tucks it under the arm and then confronted by Guerra brushed him off pretty comfortably heads for Waite versus Murphy and successfully taken as you can see by Jared Waite now Fed makes the move the dart into the pocket but uh, he's got it Collins was right away to it. Look at the Carlton supporters. We were down their quarters. They are oh, pumped. They are they pumped. The Carlton supporters. That's all they're talking about. You can see what's ahead of him. Brennan Favala for the first goal of the match. And <laughs> there's going to be one of those nights. <laughs> this is Greg, the man that we said is got to watch Mitchell. Yeah, just sauntering on through the middle of the ground. Stevens is in mind. And also Jordan Russell, who looked to lay it off. Goes with the pass. And on the end of it, guess who? It's Brendan Favola. Those forward targets, extraordinary stat, isn't it? Way out in front of all the other forwards in the league. 322 times Carlton have gone to Fev. 20-odd more than Hawthorne have gone to Lance. And they're so close as we get to the end of the season. He's going to have to kick them better than that, Fev, if he's a chance. Cameron Clint was in the goals last week, four last week, one already tonight. Big fan of Cameron Clint, uh, Wolsey. I think he's really uh, improved his game this season. Advantage paid to Carlton from the free kick, and Murphy breaks the tackle. Drills the pass. Nothing at all that Craig could do about that, but Fed spilt the beans. Austin has a go at it. Carlton still out possession. Russell gives it back to Favola from a long way out. He's made a good fist of it. Surely not. Oh, just across the face. <laughs> Trouble for the Blues. And well, for a moment he was going to pay 50 there, but uh, Darren Fife for the man that gave it up. Here's Franklin. He's got it this time. And there's no bigger man as far as the future of Hawthorne goes than this one. Lance Franklin, a nervous start tonight at the Dome in his bid for a ton from 98 to 99. One to go. It can't be long now, surely. The Buddy Show is in motion. As we have a look at the replay here, the kick from Stewie Drew actually wasn't a great kick. He had to stop and prop and go back. That is why this man is a genius and such a talent is that you don't have to actually have to kick the ball to him in the right spot. He's good enough on, a, on opponent to beat him outright one-on-one. -on -one. And it was a really relaxed kick wall as he came yep. with the boot well, and that's a good sign for him. Yes, and wasn't it a good mark? He used, he used the maximum height that he's got. He's tall. He got the arms up straight. Again, Hampson getting a handball out, giving an opportunity for his forwards. Austin was in the thick of it there. Well done, Birchall. The composure shown by Hodge. This is the running machine that the Hawks have got that does provide the threat in the finals. Lewis jabs that nicely, and the Hawks going to attack. Dishes off to Rioli. Rioli shorts it. Here's the moment. Franklin's got it. 
And a beautiful Anthony Hudson handball tool it was too. <laughs> so Lance Franklin, there's the security guards. They are lining up by the dozens. I don't think it's going to be enough. Lance Franklin. All the players are moving towards the middle of the ground in anticipation. Here he comes. On 99 goals. Lance Franklin joins the 100 club. And people power has spoken. Out they come by their thousands. Just the 28th man in 150 years of AFL to reach the magical 100. That. that is amazing. And they are coming and coming and coming. And as ridiculous as it is, it's just fantastic. It is one of the great traditions of AFL football. There's not many left. I think they've, the security men have got their man now. And he'll be uh, taken off the ground. It might be quite a few minutes before we have action again, but the plan is to take him down the race. And with a bit of luck, we will speak to Lance Franklin in the next minute or so. <laughs> Look at that. Talk about being organised. <laughs> oh, people getting photos. Can you, that is ridiculous. Can, can you believe? He's going to pull That's Robert Campbell. He's posing for photos <laughs> with his fans. Oh, I wouldn't have believed it if I hadn't seen it in my own eyes. He was posing he was for photos. He was posing for photographs. Does he realise where he's at? <laughs> So, Brendan Favola having a chat to Luke Hodge, all very friendly out there, saying it's my turn now, Lukey. Well, here's a replay at the moment for Lance Franklin. Look at the security man. <laughs> One he, poor security bloke. He won. <laughs> See, he was out, quick that number nine. Yeah. Clark, of course, has been out there himself and done that. This, I think he won the race, didn't he, this number nine? He might be the one they can find, oh. I reckon. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and with a bit of luck, we might get a question as he walks out. Mark Howard's there with the uh, microphone ready to pounce. Go, Howie. It's quarters. It's like the Rolling Stones. Big fella. The crowd was everywhere, mate. How was it? 100 goals. Yeah, it was obviously good to get out of the way in the first quarter. She decided to get back out there and make some boys. It'd be good night. Can you believe the crowd, mate? They're all over you. It's like you're Mick Jagger. Yeah, it was an unbelievable experience. <laughs> <laughs> well, what about that, boys? He is a genuine superstar, and they love him here at the Tokyo Dome. Oh, great stuff, Howie. For Vol says, I want a piece of this. <laughs> uh, we're at the 34 minute mark of the quarter. For Sewell. Stay out, Nick. Nick, stay out. With the job of minding Jart. Low ball. Here's Franklin again. Jeez, He's not hit. satisfied with two goals. He's not satisfied with 100. And it was a great kick by Sewell. So, Franklin, just a couple of steps. And uh, he shanks it. And through from behind. Run off over the top. That ends the first quarter. Well, everyone came to see Buddy kick his 100. And he's done the right thing in the first quarter. Uh, it'll be a huge amount of relief for Buddy Franklin. The whole first quarter was all about that man, and he handled himself beautifully. Kicked the footy really well, and you can see his teammates there relieved. They want to get on now and focus on uh, the chance to play in a final. Now, Brendan, I understand you wanted to come to an AFL match. Why is that? Absolutely. I've never been to one before. This is so exciting. The play is continuous. It's, what, a history-making night for, for Buddy and the Hawks. He just kicked his 100th. Everybody rushed on the stage. Yeah, see, that doesn't normally happen. That hasn't happened for quite a few Fantastic. years. Fantastic! It only happens at the end of, like, you know, the Super Bowl, occasionally. And off hands. It was Anderson to Houlihan. Uh, not a lot on offer. He goes to Favola. Good, strong hands from Brendan Favola. Converting at 66% this season. It's an unusual grip. And no. Stevens, very quiet first half. 
least with the footy. Greg Simpson now Fev. Maybe he'll come with a rush in the second half. But it's worked very well for him during the year. And he's on the ball. Ninety-three. Messi from Carlton in the middle. They lose possession on the, on the rebound. They're going to get hurt here. Rioli can almost go all the way and kick the goal himself. He does the unselfish thing to Franklin, who screws the ball around the body and in typical Franklin style, kicks the goal. And Murphy just kept on running. And a beautiful kick to Favola, who is within range to kick his second for the night. So Favola for his second. Delightful kick. can squeeze another couple in this quarter boys all is not lost Fev's back he's got to contend with two here Guerra stands in front but Favala had the read on it and here comes Fev for number 95 don't go to bed yet You've only got to look at Fev's yeah, he's got a sniff, hasn't he? Have a look at Fev's face. <laughs> he's, he, he hasn't got the sad sacks at the moment. He did it. He did in the second quarter. Don't worry about that. The lip was dragging. But all of a sudden, there's a glint in the eye. <laughs> Five to go for Brennan for Vola, And there is plenty of time left in this match. He's a burst player. We know he can kick multiple goals in a short space of time. Really dominated. Carlton have been effective when they've gone forward. Can they get it to Fev here? Yes! Well, it was in great hands with Houlihan, wasn't it? There's more fun to come tonight. He's up to 96. Alex not showing too much emotion yet. But uh, Brennan Favola, four goals in the quarter. Uh, now look at Brennan Favola, four goals in the third quarter. She's sweet, boys. I'm right. I'd, I'd, I'd start to uh, rotate the, the real cream, give them a bit of a break. I saw Brent Harvey today for the Kangaroos. He was spelled. Pfeiffer got it over the top. Favola wants it and demands it and gets it. He's got three to go. Well, well done, Simpson. If he had gone head-to-head -head with Usain Bolt then, Favola would have won. He sprinted from nowhere, demanded the footy. Fevwatch, the counter, clicks up to 97, Anthony. Quite out of danger yet. Murphy, Fev, Fev! Ah. <laughs> He's going to need to kick one or two like that, I reckon, because there's so much attention being drawn to him. He had the right idea. Murphy's given it to him. Gee, it's clever. He's put on the outside of the right boot. Then he's looked at Scotty McLaren, the umpire, and said, what about a free? Thornton. Got Gibbs in the middle. Here we go. Over the top. Is Hampson. Gives it to Stevens. Favola's on short. Favola! Yes! He's got it! <laughs> and all the current supporters. And well done, Nick Stevens. Oh. <laughs> Look at that for inside 50 targets, and why wouldn't you? Two to go! I'll tell you what, Buddy would just probably want to slot another one home, wouldn't he, just to make sure of that Coleman? <laughs> wouldn't exactly say he was jumping out of his skin. Well, we came for the shootout tonight, and we've got it. <laughs> Fev up to 98. He looked no chance at half-time. To Ladson. And he goes straight up the middle. Kicks to Campbell, to Sewell. Rough head and Franklin. Rough head had a look. And saw Buddy was coming and uh, decided to pull out of it. 
Well, this will make the Coleman safe anyway. Put it up to 102. I think we can safely say now he's going to win the Coleman. You know what I'd like to see? If Evola gets one more, we should put Lance Franklin at fullback. That's what we'd like to see, wouldn't it? Well, they've got Gillam on Favola at the moment. Here's Cloak. He goes long. Favola's got a bit of capital. Oh, he attacked it hard. He still might be his chance here. No, he's not. Hawks get numbers back. He's chasing. <laughs> Young. Like he's never chased before. <laughs> to run off. He's going to be quick here. He gets it off to Crow. He's still chasing. He's still going Favola. <laughs> he's run a marathon. He's gone. <laughs> and a good mate by Murphy taking it half back. He might need a little bit of recovery time, Fev. <laughs> oh, here's a chance now. He goes to half forward. Russell oh, to Favola. Got no, almost. Not quite. Favola screaming at the umpire. Here they come, storming through the middle. Favola again. It's going to be two. And he can't. Now, will they hold up? Surely they will. Give it to him, Brad. Oh, oh, he's been it's, it's a free kick. kick. Time left, Fed. He's, he'll kick this quickly. 99 goals for Brendan Favola. A night of drama at the time. We could not have written the script better. We are going down to the proverbial wire. We don't know how much time is left. Favola sits on 99 goals. The crowd prepares itself. <laughs> they might as well just call the game off if he gets his hundred. Down she goes in the middle. Cruz at the tap. Mitchell's in there. Latson got caught. Bateman, the long ball. Roughhead with strength. Well, that was strong play from Ruffin, who will line up for his fifth goal of the last quarter. Well, we've seen a goal-kicking feast, haven't we? Buddy, Fev. Roughhead. The best result here for Favola is a roughhead goal. <laughs> Quick, get it back to the middle. <laughs> so, roughhead for goal number five for the final turn. Well, he's back in form, Luke. He certainly is. <laughs> Have a look. I, I think the Hawks are loading their back line. They've got roughhead down there. That's not a that's, yeah, that's not that's a a disappointing. Is it? Well, that just shows how miserable Hawthorne are. <laughs> One more chance for Brendan Favola. Sewell gets it out of the middle. The crowd will tell you what they think of that. Osborne takes the mark. 99 goals, Brendan Favola. Like being stranded on 99, not out, isn't it, in cricket? The captain oh, the nice. <laughs> Osborne. Gone 30, almost 31 minutes. Michael Osborne. Again, the best result for Carlton is a goal. It is. So they'll get another crack at it. We've been looking at the record books. We don't think there has ever been a player in football history in the AFL VFL that's finished on 99 goals. Well, the Hawthorne run has gone out to Roughhead. Roughhead's been standing and now he's moved away. That's, uh, that's yeah. good. Well, that's a lovely spirit, isn't it? In the middle, Campbell attacks. Stevens is being held. He's got it out to Cruiser. Cruiser to Favola. Favola, no, no, no. Free kick. Free kick. It's a free kick to Hawthorne. It's a free kick to Hawthorne. Oh, no. Against Brendan Favola. He definitely got a free, but it must have been after he'd given one away. I mean, he, he got a lot of contact. So oh, Guerra, he's going to do a Joel Bowden. Concedes it behind for Vola. <laughs> Tackles, but... Uh, Someone's going to send the runner out to the umpire, don't they? The Hawks will be out to waste a bit of time <laughs> here. The umpires are keen, I reckon. They're the just screen. looking for anything. Murphy in the back pocket. Fev. Back in the square. 
John will try and will it down. He's got the mark. What a great effort. Chris John. He's willed himself to get there with a certain mark to the Hawks. One last go against all the odds. It's not to be there. <laughs> Get up, Fev. Get up, Fev. There's still a chance because Wake might take this. No! So near and yet so far for Fev. A great night's entertainment. 99 for Favala. But this is the man, Buddy Franklin. 100 goals for the season. And the Hawks are getting ready for the finals. What a great night for the game of Australian rules football. And Buddy, I reckon, is on his way to fair. This would be a great moment. Not a long moment, but a great moment. Uh, I agree with you, Quarters. What a great night to come and watch a game, and we've seen quite a few champions in action. Let's go down to Mark Howard. Oh, Buddy, it's a team sport, but individual honours are nice. The Coleman medal, it's a nice ring to it. Yeah, obviously, uh, it wasn't a bad year for me so far, but we've got finals to go now. Just looking forward to next week, and yeah, I'll just put that one away, so it's good. Finals are a big one, but what about that crowd? They were pushing, they were shoving, everyone wanted a piece Did you expect it to be that big? Um, I wasn't too sure what was going to happen, but um, look, it was, I reckon it's great for the game to see all the guys running in the crowd. And look, um, I reckon it's great, really good, enjoyed think, it. Did you think about it much last night or not? Um, to be honest, I didn't really think about it too much, but um, it was good to get the goals in the end and get it over and done with. I think 55,000 people wanted to see Fev bring it up. Would you like to see him bring the ton up? Yeah, definitely. It would have been great for Fev to get the 100 today, but it was not to be, so good luck for him next year. Well done today. Best of luck in the finals. Thanks very much. Brendan, you couldn't get any closer. You must be so disappointed. Oh, well, that's football. I suppose. Um, I crossed myself early. I was a bit nervous. So I don't get nervous about anything, but my first couple of kicks were shanks, but... Oh, well, um, we've had a great year, the footy club. I think we've won 10 games and we've won eight of the past two years. So it's a great effort by the young boys. And we see Murph and Gibbsy and those blokes today. They were just super. And, oh, well, hopefully I get another chance one day. But uh, I, I said to my wife, I said, I bet you I kicked 99 and it happened. So, oh, well, what can you do? You try, you try. Cheers. Well done. Well done. Great sport, Brendan Favala. 99 goals for the first time in history a player has been stuck on 99 goals